Okay, this is my recovery work, workout for injured runners. Works the core, every major muscle group. We warm up 20 minutes. Sonia O'Donnell is going to do the run. She's going to run. Actual running motion. You can bend the arms or straight arms. Straight arms probably get more resistance. And then we cross country ski. The arms and legs are locked. And then we do the breaststroke run. Running with the legs, breaststroking with the arms. And then we do the backward cycle. Reach back with one leg, and then the other leg, and swirl with the arms. Now we do one trip down the deep end. This is the deep end pool workout. One time down, back cross country skiing. Return, breaststroke run, return, backward cycle. We do four of those rotations, and then we start some drills. Drill number one, which we go for two and a half minutes, is the jumping jacks. If you're less fit, you can do it a shorter interval. Our, our workout, we go for an hour, and we do these this drill and other drills for two and a half minutes and we recover for 30 seconds. After recovery, we do opposite knee to elbow, knee to elbow, knee to elbow. So we're getting the knees high, almost to the surface, touching it with the opposite elbow. And then for the abdominals, we do a alternate toe touch. Bring your feet right out of water. Notice, she's got water shoes and she's using a water ski belt. A vest for deep end pool workouts is okay also. And now we're going to do sit kicks. Sit in a chair, extend one leg forward, the other leg back. Skull with the arms to keep afloat. This is for the hamstrings and quadriceps. And then we do a V-sit for the abdomen. V-sit. Bring the toes right out of water. Make your body into a V. Experiment with the arms. And then we go to a flutter kick. These are all two and a half minute drills. So we're reaching straight to the bottom. Notice her chin is, she's working pretty hard because her chin is well out of water. She's just fluttering the legs back and forth with straight legs, pointing the toes to the bottom. And then we do the twist for the obliques, the muscles on the sides. We also are working with the neck, strengthening the neck. She is driving one leg across the body moving the arms in the opposite direction, pushing as much weight as possible, and notice her neck goes with her leg. And then we do the Nancy Kerrigan. So we're laying flat on the back, and the farther you drive the heel into the water, the more resistance it is. She's sort of sculling with her arms to keep afloat. And then we go to the side and do the claw, which is a technique running drill. She's actually going to run or bicycle with one leg at a time, bringing the knee high and and a very short rotation and as quick as possible. That's a good one, that's good, that's perfect. And that's the nine drills, two and a half minutes each with 30 seconds rest. And then we finish up 
<laughs> going speed work. Five times 30 seconds hard, but we reverse the palms. So going backwards, palm facing back, coming forward, we bring the palm facing forward, and you can either run with the legs or flutter kick. We go as hard as we can to get the pulse rate up as high as we can for 30 seconds. And then we recover 30 seconds and we do five. If there's extra time, we might even run hard for a minute and a half to two minutes, reversing the palms. And the straighter your arms are, the more resistance you get. That is beautiful. Thank you very much, Sonia O'Donnell.